Hello and welcome. My name is Aki Coyote and this is Ghost Dragon Wildlands mission tutorial number 5. We've learned that an Unidad captain named Fuentes has been working with Yuri and Polito. Interrogate Fuentes and see what intel he can give us. Okay. After the mission briefing, Alpha. go to the mission area. It doesn't matter which way to travel you choose. I choose helicopter, you can choose car or whatever you like. Uh, this is a stealth approach. Do not assault openly. This compound is heavily fortified. Take out your binoculars and for the first step mark all three snipers. Sniper, top of the tower. One, one two, Over there, two. The the tower. and there's three. He's taking nap. Here we go. No, go. there he is. Eyes on the Unidad captain. Very important, you have to take out the snipers first. Okay, this is the Unidad firebase. We're looking for the captain who's in contact with Yuri and Polito. We need the target alive. Roger that. Ooh, well. Now You're take a drone. short glimpse with your drone and mark the other soldiers. Eyes on an Unidad grunt in the bunker. history. Copy. And you can also let your squad mate sink shot the snipers. Slowly move to your entry point, which is right next to the main gate. You can either go straight to the gate and jump over it or like I did over this container but I forgot to free the rebel prisoners behind the main gate on the left side so I suggest if you are in trouble 
you free those prisoners because they will assist you in killing the enemy soldiers. Again, take out your drone and mark the marks the left enemies which you could not mark in your first try. And as I mentioned before, there are the rebel prisoners which I forgot to free. Here is a generator which you can disable so uh, there will be no enemy reinforcements if you disable th that generator. I strongly recommend it because it's on your way to the commander. There's a helicopter which you need to fly out later on. But first kill the soldier inside this hangar and with that kill the way is free for you to go and interrogate the enemy commander yo eyes on the ground there get that in the container You may as well kill me now. I'm not talking, carajo. Well, that's your choice. But with a pair of sick fucks like Yuri and Polito, one day that might be you hanging from their ceiling. You can't trust them. At this point, some soldiers in the mess tent maybe spotted you, like they did here. But they can't really hurt you. They hit you once or twice, and that's all. Okay, Polito. So it's possible to kill them before you interrogate the commander. So no patrol will spot you. Even if you are spotted, just run to the helicopter, enter the helicopter and fly out. And that's all. Oh, I did forget to free the prisoners, but I freed them very late. Too late. So if you free them at the beginning, they will assist you if anyone is shooting at you. But as you can see, the only thing left for you to do is get in the shopper and fly out. But for fun reasons, I decided not to fly out, Fire. Roger. but instead kill a lot of reinforcements. The camp is full of supplies, so if you got the time, if you got the helicopter, if you already completed your mission and the helicopter is not too damaged, clear out the whole camp and get every supply crate you can get. There are some medical supplies, some ammunition supplies. I think there's also a skill point or a weapons mod in the building at the river. I'm not sure about it. It's either one of those. Either a skill point or a weapon mod.
It's so much fun. Flying with your computer AI in a helicopter. Also, if you freed the rebels, they will also call reinforcements, as you can see. Three in the truck on the right side, and another three from there. So you are not alone. So as I mentioned before, the earlier you free, you free the rebels, the better. In one of those buildings is either a weapon mod or a skill point, just to show you. There are also two or three soldiers, but no problem. So normally I would have show you the exact location of those. But I completed it in the first try and this is a replay. So no weapon or skill mod available anymore. Okay, and the smoke is getting bigger and bigger, so... Let's stop having fun and let's head home. Enemy down. As I mentioned before, you don't have to wait for the reinforcements. You can exit the area immediately. And as soon as you reach a specific distance from the mission area, the mission will be completed. As you can see, completed. Now there are a couple are heading back to Itakwa. All we need to do is find out exactly where the hell they're going to be. We need that standing down. We're good to go. So, I hope you liked this tutorial, if you did, please hit the like button or maybe subscribe to my channel and see you in the next tutorial, mission number 6.